All right, everybody. It's time to get down to business. Apparently, I was asked what is the most embarrassing song, in my opinion, that I have, that I, I secretly love. Okay? Well, I have one, I have one really, really, really embarrassing song. However, there are two that follow it. I had to equal out Travis's having three. I have to have at least three as well. That being said, um, I, I have uh, plenty of embarrassing songs, plenty of uh, chilling songs, but uh, probably the most, uh, probably the uh, placing on my third would definitely be Ola Mo by Erisher. Yes, there's nothing really gayer than this, can there be? Uh, nothing about a little boy getting his heart broken and uh, French show. Uh, but I like the keyboard and I like all that stuff. It's, it's, it's fun for me. It's one of those classic 80s songs that never got the light of day in terms of singles and stuff. And I, I just don't know why, but I really enjoy it. It's just it's a really bad song. It's a really, really, really gay song. And I don't mean that in an offending way, but it's it's really, you can tell it's gay. And, uh, I mean, this is, you know, after George, this is around the time George Michael was coming out, wham, and stuff. So it's, yeah. Okay. <laughs> anyway, um, yeah, that's Erisher. Number two. This was a close one, and I really, really, really thought about putting this one as number one. Uh, but, uh, number one tops this. Number two. Most second most embarrassing song I I have is by One Republic, and that is Secret. I I don't know why I, I, I like I like One Republic for some reason. I think that uh, they like the modern U2. I want to say that I know it's like heresy to some people, but um. I really like One Republic, and uh, uh, Secrets is one of those secret songs that I like, and um, I really wouldn't have it any other way. It's got a, uh, uh, some inspiring, in my opinion, lyrics, and it's a pretty, pretty good song, in my opinion, but it's one of those songs that I shy away from telling people I like, <laughs> especially, uh, yeah, okay. <laughs> But uh, topping that, of course, number one, the most embarrassing song I own is by Dispra Vandy, which is Ipo Zoe. Yeah, if you didn't hear from that clip already, you could tell this is a classic. Uh, this is a Greek pop song. It came out maybe three years ago, and it sounds like it came out from 1987, 1988. It's one of those horrible power ballads that uh, I don't know how to interpret. I don't know what it says, but I really don't care. It's a fun song to me, and I really enjoy it. Um, from the, the horrible synthesizer uh, to the I don't even know what the hell she's saying. It might be just pure bland bullshit. For all I care, but um, yeah, I must have been extremely trashed when I was in Greece when I saw when I listened to this. So that being said, um, that is my top three most embarrassing songs that I have, and yep, it's pretty embarrassing. With that in mind, uh, I'll finish it off with my most embarrassing song. This is Ipa Zoe. <laughs> Legends don't understand why she's like this. Soft, soft.